Yes, yes, yes. Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is T-Man and I'm just going to be doing some tips, tricks and tutorials. So if you're new to the channel here, what I do on the channel is I say yes, please to things. Uh, it has to be music related or it like something to do with the studio or artists really. So at the moment, I'm just trying to get a little schedule going and I'm going to be doing on Monday my mixes. So Gonna be like a mixed up Monday, and I'm gonna have. Um, I'm either gonna do mi live mixes, uh, EP specials, album specials, artist specials, or just could be anything from acid techno to jungle music, really. And um, that'll be my Monday. Wednesdays, no, sorry, I missed out Tuesday. <laughs> Tuesdays today, so it's gonna be tips, tricks, and tutorials, and that is on the double sided sticky Velcro tape the heavy duty stuff wednesdays is going to be like a yes please video so wednesday i'll be saying yes please to anything so it could range from say yes please to some gear tractor s2 mark 3 or a keyboard a plug-in on use on ableton uh artist radio station um just so i don't get bored and i cover the whole spectrum but it's all going to be music related obviously and then Friday will be the Yes Please live show. So if you um, if I set it up, Nat, just come in. We have a chat and we'll play some music. And then Friday, anything goes, really. Then in between, I'll be doing video logs. So I've changed a lot of stuff in here at the moment. So I've had some problems, as we all do. And um, I'll just be kind of doing a bit of production on the side as well. Right. So let's get to it. So it is Tuesday's tips, tricks and tutorials day. And that is what I'm going to be showing you that I've set up. So let me get it up on the camera. So there we go at there. You saw my last video. That was the Atella USB 3.0 hub. And I bought that one ages ago. And I got another one which is really similar. And they're all set up with my PC at the moment. So the problem with um, a lot of these things is stuff that pulls so like these are quite light and flimsy and you've got loads of different usbs going in it's the same with mixers and things like the lightweight desktop mixer uh, they get pulled so what i've done is i've put on some velcro so you get a roll of heavy duty velcro and there that side you can cut all you need is some scissors or a standing knife and you just cut the shape that you want and then you can stick it to the back and then the fluffy side or the other way around to the item that you want to stick to the table or desk so this is a little drawer that have come in these little things come in handy as well so if i want to unplug a cable and i don't want to drop it to the floor i just put it that on there and obviously there's my light under there it's shining down so they are velcroed on as well. So they usually come with a little adapter box um, for USBs and then they're really awkward. I've got another USB hub under there that's also velcroed as well. So I'll show you the other one. Pretty simple. Cut the shape you want, measure, cut the shape you want, stick it on. Um, and I know it's like, it's really simple, but sometimes you can just think, oh, why have I been doing that? You can get used to pulling things. I've done it loads of times. And over time, I've seen people blue tack, glue things, sellotape them, put them on bloody bits of bread. I don't know anything, foam, stuff like that. So whatever works for you, but this one works for me and it keeps it nice and sorted. So I'll get up the... Um... So I've just typed in heavy duty Velcro tape. It's the self adhesive black. So this is the one I've got here. I did not buy this off Amazon. I bought this from a shop. But I'm just going to show you so you can have a look. So I've got the one meter one. And apparently it holds up to seven kilos. So if you want to move your music gear around and keep it in place, or if it's moving while you're jamming, some of these lightweight keyboards and controllers, they, they are a bit flimsy. They're, and if you're getting cheaper ones like PD3 or Akai controller, they're always kind of plastic in and not like just heavy duty so when you're playing they can move um that's where it there so if you can see there that's a one side stick down so i've stuck that to the 
draw or to the table and then the fluffy side to the actual thing so this one is going for seven pound 19 they look like on amazon they range between five pound and 17 pound depends how many rolls you get how long the roll is as well um obviously you'll make that choice but all i'm saying is if you like me i sometimes you just want things to pay for it but then you'll see it in a shop later and you go oh i could have saved money on that so always go for a saving money i think i got mine from quite possibly poundland or bnm or somewhere it was only a couple of quid so check poundland check their little um diy section and uh, if not pound stretcher or obviously if you're in the uk i'm naming these shops if you've got other shops other way check them um screw fix might have a more home base so i bought some little hooks on there and they were actually more picture frame hooks they were actually more on amazon than they were in home base so i got them from there so that is pretty much it really so let me get, just get the camera back up sorry about that right so that is it where's my box gone there it is that's the one I got there. So that's the one you've seen on the camera. That is the heavy duty stick on um, up to like a meter. 100 or 10. Yeah. And or you can get it in different sizes, seven. And that takes up to seven kilos. And that is Velcro spelt with all capitals. I believe that is the thing. So I'll leave a link in the description and you can check them out. And that is it. So thank you for tuning in. My name is T-Man. If you like my stuff, then give us a subscribe and I'll see you later.